Hello and welcome to Defend the Highlands. Terrible news, Larry. I've just heard that the Irish, Welsh and English have invaded Scotland. They'll be at your pub any minute now. You better get the lads ready for a fight. First things first, Larry. you got to know how to command your Scotsman. You'll need to use the WASD or arrow keys to move your camera. That's right. Now hold down the middle mouse button and move the mouse to rotate the camera. Good one, lad. Now scroll the mouse wheel up and down to raise and lower the camera. That's all there is to it, lad. Now, you're going to need to give orders to your Scotsman. First, select a Scotsman by clicking him with the left mouse button or clicking and dragging a box around multiple Scotsmen. To give orders to the selected Scotland. Scotsman, right click where you want him to go. We'd best stock up in porridge before the invasion, so let's start by getting one of the lads onto an oat field. Remember though, your hero character oh, a hero can he harvest oats. That's a brilliant plan! We've got a field in the bar. Right, you are, Chief. Uh, that's a relief to have a bit more porridge in the stockpile. Now, if you run out of porridge, your men will desert you. If we're going to repel this invasion, we'd best get some more Scotsmen to come help out. If you get some of your lads to play the bagpipes, it will summon some more Scotsmen. Select a Scotsman and press the play bagpipes button. What is a lad? It looks like we've got a new recruit. Just remember the more Scotsmen you have, the faster you go through your porridge stockpile. So make sure you balance your bagpipe playing with your porridge plan. We'll have to build up our defences a wee bit. We've got a bit of money in the bank, so let's buy a few more tables to use as barricades. Press the table barricade button, move the mouse to position the barricade, and scroll the mouse wheel to rotate it. When you're happy, click the left mouse button to place it. That's going to give our lads a bit of an edge. The first of the Irishmen have arrived. To arms! Come here, Jason, you shall end. The Irishmen give a deadly barrage of tackles. Make sure you keep your Scotsmen in cover. To order a Scotsman to take cover, select them and right click in a barricade. Hey, laddie! to send some men onto the balcony up there so you can hit them from the flank. Alfredo's in trouble! Get him out of here! It's all gonna be over! Oh no! We lost one of our porridge farmers! We get another lad onto that oak field and we're gonna run out of porridge. Terrible news, laddie. I've just heard that the Irish, Welsh and English have invaded Scotland. They'll be at your pub any minute now. You better get the lads ready for a fight. First things first, laddie. You gotta know how to command your Ugh, this tutorial. To use the WASD or arrow keys to move your camera. That's right. Now hold down the middle mouse button and move the mouse to rotate the camera. Good one, lad. Now scroll the mouse wheel up and down to raise and lower the camera. Hi, laddie. Hi, boss man. That's all there is to it, lad. Now, you're going to need to give orders to your Scotsman. First, select a Scotsman by clicking him with the left mouse button or clicking and dragging a box around multiple Scotsmen. To give orders to the selected Scotsman, right click where you want him to go. We'd best stock up in porridge before the invasion, so let's start by getting one of the lads onto an oat field. Remember though, your hero character Alfredo can he harvest oats. That's a relief to have a bit more porridge in the stockpile. Now, if you run out of porridge, your men will desert you. If we're going to repel this invasion, we'd best get some more Scotsmen to come help out. 
If you get some of your lads to play the bagpipes, it will summon some more Scotsmen. Select a Scotsman and press the play bagpipes button. It looks like we've got a new recruit. Just remember the more Scotsmen you have, the faster you'll go through your porridge stockpile. So make sure you balance your bagpipe playing with your porridge farm. We ought to build up our defences a wee bit. We've got a bit of money in the bank, so let's buy a few more tables to use as barricades. Press the table barricade button, move the mouse to position the barricade, and scroll the mouse wheel to rotate it. When you're happy, click the left mouse button to place it. Good. That's going to give our lads a bit of an edge. The first of the Irishmen have arrived. To arms! Irishmen give a deadly barrage of tactics. Make sure you keep your Scotsman in cover. To order a Scotsman to take cover, select him and right click on a barricade. You'll need to consider your tactics if you want to defeat the Irishman. You might want to send some men onto the balcony up there so you can hit them from the flank. We showed them how Scotsmen fight. Watch out though, there's going to be more of them. We've managed to loot some money from the Irishmen. We can use it to build some more barricades. Looks like the English cricket team once are in the action. Careful, these guys are tougher and they can even destroy our barricades. You've got as many Scotsmen as you can support with these alt fields. You might want to lay up in the bagpipes or we're going to run out of porridge. Bye laddie! We need to rebuild the defences before the next attack. This is it, laddie. Defeat this lot and your pub's going to be saved. Lost one of our porridge farmers, but get another lad onto that oak field, or we're gonna run out of porridge.
ourselves true Scotsmen today, but the fight's not over yet, they're still out there, gallivanting around the village, let's go give them what's war.
Just lost the old field. Okay, this has been Defend the Highlands. I just wanted to give you guys an idea of what the game's all about. So thanks for watching.